Hey, so uh, education, okay? The arm, yesterday's example, the arm uh, can learn all the basic functions of an arm and what an arm can accomplish, will accomplish, may accomplish, or could accomplish, right? And then every separate part of the arm, say the bicep, the triceps, and the elbows, and all this other stuff, might uh, take on education for their particular part. Like a bicep couldn't take on the training that an elbow needs. You know what I'm saying? An elbow couldn't learn what a tricep needs to know. But all of that being said, now the arm has its basic fundamental education and each part can delineate and uh, get a sketch of what their education is going to be about as individual parts but they still all need to know where the commandments are coming from and that comes from the head right the brain sends nerve impulses through the body to let the arm know what it's doing to begin with so an arm can only have an idea of what the arm does if it knows uh, about the body and the basic functions of the body. And so, so is the Church of Christ. Uh, the Church of Christ, there needs to be that fundamental education of the Father. And that's what Jesus says in John 6, 44 and 45. Anyone who learns from the Father comes to me. And the, not me, but Jesus Christ. And so everybody who learns from the Father knows why they need a savior they come to the savior they are freed and then in that relationship each person grows and uh, Paul tells Timothy that there are apostles and teachers and and various different levels of uh, of uh, utility to let the body know what each part does and uh, each part knows what it is and to sit there for a bicep to say, oh, I want to be an elbow and start learning the process of an elbow, that bicep will not be a very good elbow and the elbow couldn't take the place of the bicep, okay? And so, and none of them, the whole arm, none of the arm could get instructions from the, the mind uh, sent and receive nerve impulses if it didn't learn from the body, the, the core principles of the body. Uh, and then there's other members, legs, with each individual part of the leg, and uh, uh, there's a torso with each individual part of the torso. Uh, say the mind detects an itch in the kneecap, and so it sends a message to the arm to scratch the kneecap, right? And so every part working together functions has a whole body with no schisms in it. And uh, that's what the church is supposed to be. It's supposed to be functioning with no schisms, but we see the church of today kind of <laughs> full, full of schisms, huh? Hey, have a good day. Uh, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year.